Hey guys, so now we're going to talk about tension headaches. So what is different about tension headaches? So um, like I said, each type of headache is a little bit different in its symptoms. So this is where you're going to want to either make a table, draw it out, something like that to make it, uh, make it different in your head. So you don't need to write everything that's the same, just what's different. Um, so people that have tension headaches, um, they're going to complain of feeling like their head is being squeezed. It's almost going to be like a band-like pain, like a band around their head, like you can see in this picture, go all the way around their head. It can even be in their neck, um, like neck tightness. Um, they could have like resistance to passive of movement. So like if they have a tension headache, it might hurt if you try to move or flex their neck. Um, they can have neck tenderness. Um, they may describe it as being very tight um, and um, in, in their muscles and things like that, especially in their neck. They can have sensitivity to light and like noise and things like that, but there's no nausea, vomiting, no GI symptoms. So really this is more of like a muscular thing, like they're tense, tight, um, squeezing, um, uh, squeezing kind of pain. Um, there's no aura either, which we'll talk about auras, but um, there's just a lot of um, tightness and tension here in the neck and then that band-like pain around the head um, and um, not a lot of other symptoms that usually come with it. It's mostly just like that, that really tight band. So what do we do to treat it? Um, overall, uh, we start with the least invasive first. So we usually start with acetaminophen if that will work for them. Um, and if you'll remember the teaching for acetaminophen is going to be things like liver function testing, you know, avoiding alcohol while you're taking it and, you know, making sure you're taking no more. I think it's like you're not supposed to do more than, is it like four grams a day or something like that? So just making sure you're not getting over the max dose. Um, then also after that, aspirin or NSAIDs. Um, and so what complication do I need to watch out for this? If you remember, it's bleeding. So um, we definitely want to be careful and cautious about that. Uh, muscle relaxants um, or relaxers. Um, these help because remember, this is more of like a musculoskeletal pain. So if it's tense, tight pain, this is going to relax those tense, tight muscles. Um, and can, that can therefore help with the pain. Um, and then also even just warm compresses to the back of the neck. And I should say, it should say to the back of the neck. Um, that can help as well because it's going to relax that muscle tension. Okay. Oh, wow. That was quick. I thought there was going to be more because I think I, I structured my uh, my headache stuff differently. So that's the end for tension headaches, but there'll be more about other general treatments and stuff at the end. See you next for migraines.